Hey, hey, everybody. I figured I'd do a quick surprise uh, live stream at a little bit different time than usual, just so uh, people can join up um, who can't usually join at the at the typical time. Uh, and also, I'm super excited about these uh, platform category Im images from Giant Titan, and he's just nailed them. They're beautiful. So. And I love, I love uh, James Baker's arcade video here as well. I've already demoed that, but you know, it just, I'm loving the experience so far, guys. It's too late, you need sleep? Then go to sleep, Ali. Go to sleep. But anyways, I'm just, I'm in love with this, guys. I really love, I love those images. And I'm looking forward to <laughs> getting some more um, videos of James Baker going, but of course right now we have uh, uh, Vikings videos and they're gorgeous as well, so Good 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 So I just wanted to hit you guys up and see who was on and you know have a little bit of fun here for a few minutes um, My daughter is actually sleeping in the next room, so if she wakes up we might have a surprise visit from her, but you know That is that's the deal. Hey, Pure Luck, Wade, Luke, yes, more Launchbox. Well, I can't stay away from you guys, apparently, because I just keep streaming. But I did just put a beta out, uh, beta 4, 7.9 beta 4, just went out earlier, a uh, couple hours ago. Uh, we got a bunch of new stuff in there. The, um, <clears throat> speed from going, uh, the the speed when you go from the pl the arcade, man, I'm, I'm, I can't talk. The speed of when you go from the platform categories to the actual platforms is quicker now. There's really no delay in there, at least on my system. So I'm curious to know, uh, you know, how well that works in other people's systems. So that is new um, for the latest beta, and then also we added in Launchbox. Um, of course, uh, managing, editing the platform categories. <clears throat> so there's now a window and all that management stuff in Launchbox for editing the platform categories. And we did that in the live stream this morning. What else? Um, these images are now included by default. Um, so when you load them up in your collection for the first time, the platform categories in Big Box, it's automatically gonna put those images there until you replace them with something else or just leave them because they're gorgeous. So that's where we're at. Yeah, he just whipped them out so quick. I mean, in just a couple of days, he had these out. And uh, this guy's awesome. Giant Titan is amazing because uh, in the live stream this morning, or no, it was, I'm not sure if it was Monday. We first checked these out and they were and they were beautiful. Um, but they were black and white, basically. They didn't have a lot of color in them. And they looked awesome, but they needed a little bit more color so they would pop in big box. And he uh, took that, he, he just, he was more than willing to just run with it and tweak it for us. And man, he just, he nailed it. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm loving it. Just absolutely loving it. Yeah. Hey, Remix. Shanzo, uh, no kidding, man. Absolutely, thank you. It's only 1.10 a.m. Hey, Neil. <clears throat> Is there ever going to be another giveaway? Of course there will. Yeah, we'll do another giveaway. Uh, like I said, I'm surprised how, how often I get that question. I'm glad you guys appreciate those giveaways. We uh, will we'll probably do one every few months, something like that. So it'll be another couple months before we do a giveaway. But yeah, we will do another another 100 license giveaway, I'm sure soon enough. Thank you, Dave. Well, I gotta say thanks to Giant Titan for those logos, though. It's amazing. Hey, Kato. Ha! <laughs> 2109. I gotta do the math in my head because I'm not used to seeing 24-hour uh, time. So it's like, okay, what is that? Uh, 9 o'clock p.m., something like that. And my, uh, uh, you know what it is. Just kicked in. Yeah. 
<clears throat> One thing that's interesting is uh, switching up the view. Because, <coughs> of course, we got lots of different views for uh, this stuff. And this certainly isn't my favorite view. But uh, this, yeah, this looks a lot better. And that's not a bad transition there. Uh, but it's not perfect in this in this format. There's there's other transitions that work be better in the vertical format. So that's one thing that's interesting is uh, depending on the view you're using for your platform categories, you might want to switch up the transition, which is available. I gotta unlock this, of course. Under transitions platforms list transition so we can change this up to fade for example or slide left and uh, slide horizontal would be would probably be better for uh, this particular view that's fade let's go into transitions um, there's a lot of cool ones you can use some of them don't work the greatest though because it's a complicated thing to transition. So the slides and the fades are probably the best. I just did the wrong, the wrong thing, didn't I? We don't want slide vertical, we want slide horizontal. There it is. So slide horizontal in the vertical view for, to me looks better. Unfortunately it won't switch up automatically though depending on the view you've got. So I don't know, I'm tempted to do something about that <laughs> about that because it's uh, not ideal. So cool. It's funny, these these uh, these logo images look so good that it kind of makes the console logos look like crap. Which is just funny. It's, really, it's pretty funny to me. I like this. Uh, I think it was Gorilla who came up with the concept of fading the wheels in and out. Uh, we've been wanting to do that for a long time, but Gorilla actually came up with the theme code to make it happen. So, that's pretty pretty awesome. The latest, the, uh, the latest uh, Critical Zone, City Hunter themes all do that, and there's some other themes that do that as well. <clears throat> but I still love this view the best. <coughs> Thank you, Susan. How powerful of a PC do you need to run this properly? Well, I'll tell you what, we just ran this on the GPD Win. So go check out the GPD Win video, Red. That is a very low end PC, and we're able to run run this particular theme. There is some slowdown, but we are, are able to run this particular theme without too much trouble. So you don't need that amazing of a PC. It used to be that you really needed an amazing PC to run this stuff, uh, but we've worked hard on the performance aspects of it and so you really don't need that great of a PC you can run this even on um, the GPD win now uh, which is great there are other themes that are that are much quicker to run though so you know you don't need anything that special so when you download the normal version it's just launchbox but if you spend twenty dollars you get big box right correct yes big box comes with launchbox premium and it costs twenty bucks that's exactly correct. Thank you, Neil. Michael. <coughs> yeah, dude, you got to get yourself a machine. <coughs> or a GPD win now, even. Take it easy, Ali. Good night. Thank you, Red. Gorilla is a legend indeed. Hey, Aiden. Yeah, that is true. An SSD will make a big difference in Big Box. Um, the hard drive performance does matter quite a bit, especially if you're jumping from a crappy hard drive like a 5400 RPM hard drive. Um, that's going to make a big difference. And so maybe one of the reasons why it works so well on um, a mobile device like the GPD Win is because. There is an. It is running off of a. Well, actually, it's running off of a flash drive. The whole thing is running off of a flash drive, which, if you 
consider that. It's a USB flash drive, so maybe, I don't know. Uh, but even that is fast enough, so. All right, what are we in here? Capcom CPS1. <clears throat> but anyways, guys, I just wanted to hit you all up and show off these images, because I love them. Uh, I mean, I, we couldn't have asked for better images from the community, so huge thanks to Giant Titan for these awesome, awesome platform category images. There is one more. There's one for pinball as well. I just don't have pinball in my collection. So, if you guys keep the comments going, I'll stick around for a while to keep answering comments, but other than that, we'll, we'll uh, move on. Hey, KK. The GPD Win has four gigabytes of RAM, yes, and that's extremely important. You're not going to get very far on Windows with two gigabytes. That's uh, that leaves almost nothing for apps. So yeah, the, G the four gigabytes of RAM is crucial. If you don't have four gigabytes of RAM, you might as well give up. Unfortunately for Big Box, I, I wouldn't even bother. Um, that's like because the thing is, there's lots of big images going on in Big Box, and it needs to keep a lot of images in memory, or it's gonna it's gonna choke. So that's pretty important. The karaoke. Did you add console add-on subcategories while I was while you were gone? No, I did not. <laughs> Sorry, PC player. Is the Emu movies login still down? I heard that earlier today. I haven't I haven't uh, checked up on it, but I I don't know. Um, like I said earlier, make sure Circo knows about it if you guys haven't. <coughs> Circo over Emu movies. Thank you, Wade. I'm glad to hear it. Emu movies seems back up. That's good. <laughs> Gato Soft says he's using a tablet with one gigabyte of RAM, and even Big Box works pretty swift. Well, hey, if it works, it works. That I would not expect, but hey, hey, I'm glad to hear it's working. I did not turn my Xbox on, but it thinks I did. It just turned on over there. Thank you, Ack. I really appreciate that. That is good to hear. <clears throat> well, cool, guys. I hope you, everybody has a good evening. I'm going to go ahead and uh, end the stream. Just wanted to show this off real quick at a different time so that, you know, some different people could join up. But uh, it's been good. Uh, hoping to put out the 7.9 release early next week. So that is the plan. And of course, this stuff is all in the beta. We got some weird stuff going on here, but weird view. But uh, anyways, that's about it. Have a good one, guys.